We begin here first tonight with a story out of CMS. The district saying that its newly installed body scanners are working. This after one found a gun at a local high school. CMS says a student at Philip O'Berry Academy of Technology set off that scanner with a loaded gun this morning. WCNC Charlotte's Kendall Morris joins us live. Kendall, while there have been more than two dozen weapons on CMS campuses this year, this is the first weapon uh, one of these body scanners has detected. Yeah, that's right, Fred. And CMS just started rolling out these body scanners in some of its high schools in phases about a month ago. Philip O'Berry just installed them last week even. So now this is catching weapons on campus and it is causing alarm among the campus community, but it is reassuring to know that they are doing their job. As students walked through the doors of Philip O'Berry Academy of Technology Monday morning, body scanners are now part of the daily route to class. They put us in single file lines and we walked through the metal, de metal detectors. So uh, nothing, nothing caught me, so <laughs> I was good. So I, I went about my day. The body scanners are a new addition to many CMS high schools within the last month. The district rolling them out to seven schools first before expanding to others. Philip O'Berry is included in phase three. CMS says the gun at Philip O'Berry was found on the second day the scanners were on campus. The scanners bringing some comfort to those with students at the school. Oh, wow, that's a blessing. I didn't know that. Y'all must have me cry down today. Yeah, I didn't know that. CMS says a total of 26 guns have been found on campuses this school year. God. Calls for more safety measures like body scanners picking up after a fight broke out at Hopewell High last fall, leading to two guns being seized. Well, yeah, it makes me feel better, but I didn't know they had it here, but yeah makes me feel 80% better. One student at Philip O'Berry saying he doesn't mind the body scanners and feels like they are more of a necessity nowadays. So I don't think it's going to be anything tomorrow. <laughs> hopefully, seeing that somebody already got caught. So hopefully that, you know, puts them on guard. Students' daily routine changing to keep everyone safe as they walk inside the building. And a CMS spokesperson tells me that phase three of the body scanner rollout will be complete in the next couple of weeks. When it is finished, there will be a total of 20 high schools within CMS with these body scanners in place. Live in West Charlotte, Kendall Morris, WCNC Charlotte. Kendall, thank you.